Alright, see what we got here. So, well, I've been waiting for this for a while. So, it's from Boolean. And it's uh, one of those uh, mini slim wallets. And um, I can show you my wallet now. Hold on one second. Okay, I'm going to ask you Price, I'm trying to record it. So, right now, here's my wallet now. It's a big, honky looking thing. I'm not going to open it up because my stuff's in there. It sits about that thick. It's looking pretty bad and beat up. Um, look at the left, it's all coming off like crap. So, I want to get a new one. So, been looking up slim wallets and figure out how to move into that category and see if I like it or not. And the good thing about this one, at least doing my research, is that it's not so thin, it's not the ultra thin, um, so it holds more things, which is good. That's what I need. I don't want something too thin. All right, nicely packaged here in the box. That's good. First off, first views of the wallet, uh, it looks like it's made out of good material. It says it's leather. This is a, I love the finger holes so, so you can get your ID out. So this would be for your main ID and you can just pull it out in here. On the back side there's going to be a couple of pockets here as well. With another unit with another weight uh, thumb hole to slide up your um, cards up. So that's good. Let's open it up. I kind of like the color in it too. It's kind of cheesy but I like it. It's brown. It comes with the money clip. This money clip is removable. So if you want to remove it, you can remove it. Um, definitely is tight. It will hold your money well. And there's actually a coin purse on here. Not sure who still carries change, but if you carry change, that's great. Um, the clip, like I said before, it is removable. So you can, it goes up and down. There it is there. You can remove it if you don't carry, carry a lot of cash. And a lot of people don't use cash anymore. Also, too, it's got an RFD blocker on it, so it keeps your card safe. No one can just walk by you and scan for you to get your information. This bad boy here probably will let everyone get this information out of it. Um, minus the tough leather is surrounded in. So maybe um, maybe that might keep me safe. I don't know. But now I'm going to convert over to this wallet here. Just really wanted to try it. Um, they range from prices of 10 bucks to about 110 bucks, maybe more. I think I paid about 11 or 12 for this. I'll put the link below in the description. Want to try it out if I like it, and there's other models out there that's better. I will take a look at those, but for now, this is a good experiment. It's 12 bucks. If I like it, I like it. If I don't, I don't, and we can move on for there. But I do like the, the, the many pockets you have here, and the the way you can put your IDs in here, and then you put them put your main debit or credit card in here, and we have easy access to it. And maybe some of the cards you don't use as much, maybe like your medical cards, or maybe. You know, credit cards you only use once on a blue moon, you can put inside these other compartments. So that works out. And you can actually put some in there as well. It'd be a tight fit, but it's a pocket though. So uh, I might actually take my money clip off and put my cash inside this pocket here. That way, no one, every time I pull my wallet out, no one can see me. No one can see what I have. All right, so. If you use one of these wallets before, let me know. Uh, just Ron here. Just wanted to share this box, open box with you. Like I said, here's the product here. I put a link below. Everybody, um, be safe. Take care out there. Just run out.